Hey fam, today is Wednesday and we are out of the house again. Just Gerald and I, we're gonna go out for a little mini date night. Anyway, he wanted me to drive so he can vlog, but I'm like, we <laughs> we haven't even, what? Oh sorry there, let me cut it off like this. <laughs> Cause if I go like this, I'm in your way, your uh, rear view mirror. Oh he's feeding me. Okay there, let's go like that. He's feeding me. <laughs> anyway, um, oh, I don't like the lighting right now because the sun is like in a weird position. It's 621, so it's like getting closer to twilight. Um, let's go like, it's like this. Seven o'clock on the dot. Seven o'clock on the dot. What was I saying? I have been craving Korean barbecue because all over my Snapchat, people are posting Korean barbecue. So I'm like, now I want Korean barbecue. You're going to bunch on. No, I don't want to go to Bonchon. I'm kind of tired of Bonchon. In the previous vlog, you guys were right. We went to Bonchon that night. Okay, Gerald is hungry, you guys, but here is their Bonchon. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I figured you were hungry. You started eating before I vlogged. I love like the silverware and like this style of Korean barbecue because it's so cute. Look. We got our little piece of fat right there to grease up our um, the grill. <laughs> we got some vegetable tempura. Yeah, their banchan looks good. I don't even know everything on here. I think that's japchae, some kimchi, some sauces. Their salad looks good though. I'm excited to dig in. And we just ordered our meats right now. I love all of the stainless steel um, dishes here. It kind of reminds me of Holbeck. That's like my favorite place since Elaine and Gilbert introduced us there oh my gosh it's been bomb I like how everything is just sleek and chic I think I don't know I guess the fat on there is brisket fat and she is now she has the um bris this is the brisket right oh, right the brisket on the grill that's hair. no that's but not hair. I know, it's shrimp hair. Shrimp hair. <laughs> oh, I just dropped my chopstick, babe. Anyways, you guys. He's about to tap out. We still have a lot of food. I don't know, I just can't eat that, but um, it's pretty good. I like pullback better. I'm about to pop my button, because I can't really eat. Okay, we just finished dough. What'd you think, babe? He didn't like it. I, you know what? It was just I right for me, but he said if I want to ever come back, that's where we ate. To do, I'm on my own. <laughs> now we're on our way to Gelatology, which is just right here next door. Not really next door, but same shopping area. They have really good gelato and other desserts. Ooh, what's this? Hi. Oh, whoopie pies, neat, interesting, sounds good. No, but um, since you guys had the whoopie pies. Oh, okay, great. Yeah. Cool. So they have green tea, velvet, red velvet whoopie, a mini whoopie trio, ube whoopie. Ooh, they got ube, they got love for the Filipino community. What kind of flavors you guys have today? Oh, I love that one, the Fior de, la de Latte, the sweet cream, that one's really good. What do they have? I want to try Ube Kit Kat. That one sounds so interesting. Thank you. Ube Kit Kat. Sounds good, huh? You don't like ube? I do. Okay. Ew. <laughs> Gerald's stupid. There's a foot spa right next to dough, and he said that's where they get their marinade from. That's disgusting. Oh, I had to burp. Thank you, honey. We got the smallest size. We got two flavors so we can share because we're just stuffed. Um, we got the coffee caramel and my favorite, the sweet cream. Anyway, now we're on our way to Westgate. Um, that's where the the show is. Um, you know what we like to do when we're like out and about like this? We pretend we're lovers. Like earlier, Gerald said he wanted to say, "You should pay this time because last time what, babe? My wife." <laughs> 
my shirt is really awkward right now it's supposed to be like off the shoulders but look this is hanging out it's not staying because I'm vlogging you and know, my outfit just don't look cute like that you know what I paid for the ice cream hmm. I told the girl you know she was four bucks mm -hmm. I said, hey you owe me you owe me two dollars get a smirk on her face when you told me that right yeah. <laughs> yeah Gerald's keeping tabs on me he's pretending pretending yeah he told me that he goes hey you owe me two dollars for that the girl probably thought what a cheap date he can't even pay for her half <laughs> this is gonna be awkward because okay there now i can pull it out a little bit because if if i extend my arm anymore my arm my shoulder sleeves are gonna go up got a few compliments from you guys on snapchat about this my choker it's actually not a choker it's actually a headscarf which I just turned into a, a like a little handkerchief choker it's got like a paisley print it's got some yellow in there so I thought maybe it'll go <laughs> I don't know I just kind of whipped it up really quick after I put my makeup on yeah and somebody asked if I'm gonna have this on my Etsy shop um, unfortunately I'm not because I only have one of these head wraps it was like an old head wrap I had in the closet and I just kind of zigazang zang zigazang zang it up <laughs> I don't know I just felt like saying that why are you trying to snap me I'm trying to take a selfie it's been 30 minutes no I I'm kind of annoyed because look how high my heels are and he's parked instead of valet. Just right here, dude. That's not just right here, that's far. Are you strapped? Yeah. No, oh, you're not. Show them your guns, show them. Show it's them. <laughs> I'm making Gerald hold the camera. If I vlog with this shirt, it's gonna go up, so. He'll be my cameraman as I speak to you guys. Any park far and you have to walk really far. I'll show them my shoes. See, and I have to walk in these. <sighs> We're gonna go see him. Yeah. Vinny Favorito. <laughs> Unfiltered. <laughs> You don't know how to vlog. Look, I said we're gonna see him and I'm not pointing and he's still pointing I can't see it from here. Look, what? if you never met me, you'd still be dressed like this. Show them. Like where? Right here. Show them. Just turn the camera around. <laughs> see? <laughs> yeah. Like Dude. <laughs> I'd be walking. All of your long sleeve button up shirts right there, babe. Oh, and right there. Oh, oh please. We traded drinks because I didn't like my apple martini. I'd rather have this Corona. It looks funny because I'm all manly and Gerald girly. <laughs> Pinky's up. Okay guys, we are now in waiting to see Vinny Favorito unfiltered. Hi babe, we got good seats, huh? Yeah. Oh my god. Wife and girlfriend. My wife. You did good, Joe. She's hot. Where do you rip? <laughs> <laughs> we just finished watching Vinny. Here he is. He's so funny. Very funny. Thank you, Terry. But does your husband give you a piggyback ride when your feet hurt? <laughs> Fuck you. I'm stupid. I'm not that heavy. <laughs> They're making fun of the people next to you and you laugh. I know. It seems like you're, making, you're laughing at them. That show was hilarious. It's 
It seems like it's one of those underrated shows here in Vegas, but I highly, highly recommend it. If you guys are ever in Vegas, you want to see a show, not sure of which one. I and It was a small show. He's been here for a long time in Vegas, but different venues. He's new at the um, Westgate. His name is Vinny Favorito. He's a comedian, but if you're easily offended, I won't recommend it to you. But if you're game and you're down to laugh at yourself, at everybody else, he is hilarious. I think me and Gerald, we got lucky. If you follow me on Snapchat, you've seen a clip of that, but he caught me. He was like, put that phone away. He was bad with some people, huh, babe? He, was, he makes fun of like everybody, like from your race, from how you look, how you speak, everything. But I think Gerald and I, I think we got we were safe. Yeah, we got away because he made fun of an Asian right, right before, before us. us. He was making fun of an Asian guy with an accent right before us. So when he finally came to us, and then um, he asked Gerald, "Are you Asian too?" And he goes, "Yes." And then he goes, um, "Do you work at the post office?" <laughs> no, he asked if I was Filipino. Oh, he asked if you were Filipino. No, he asked what I was. If I was a Asian, he said, "What type of Asian are you?" Uh huh. Filipino. Oh, and then that's when he said, do you work at the post office? <laughs> Is there a lot of Filipinos at the post office? Yeah. Surprised he didn't say, are you a nurse? Oh, I know. And then he asked, go babe. And then he asked if I was his wife. And then Gerald said, yeah. He goes, oh, you did good. She's hot. He said that. And I thought he was going to go in on me. I don't know. Tell me I have too much makeup on or make fun of what I was wearing or how I looked. I was really scared. Um, and then he just asked me for my name and what I did. And I said, um, my name was Kat. And then the only thing he said about us that was not really bad, I laughed with it, was, oh, Kat, that's what you guys eat, right? That's what you people eat. That's what you people eat. That's all he said about us. And then he went on and got into everybody else's things. Oh my god. But yeah, that was hilarious. Now we're gonna go home. It's only 10.25. My mom texted me around 8.45 and said all the kids were sleeping. Um, so that's good. Now we're just gonna go home. I gotta wake up early and take the kids to school. Gerald works tomorrow night. So he'll get to sleep in. That was funny. I had fun. That was a good show, huh? We had a good laugh. I think my stomach hurts from laughing so hard. If you're easily offended. Don't watch it. There was a lot of people that walked out. They couldn't take it. There were some older people that... Because he makes fun of every race. Every race. He gets political. He gets... He was making fun of this chick's nose. He did? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. <laughs> he was making fun of, like, where people are... Where, like, you know, where they came from and what they did for a living and... Oh my gosh, yeah, if you guys are easily offended, it wouldn't be for you. But if you guys are game like we are and open-minded, just, it's, it's a joke, go. Vinny Favorito.